Hey guys, uh, what's going on? Uh, here I got my iPod Touch G1 and uh, SBAG 129's iPod Touch uh, 2G. Actually, I said G1, I meant 1G, but whatever. Um, Alright, we're just pretty much going to do a comparison between uh, the two and show you the pros and cons of each, even though there's not really that many pros to the G1 to the G2. Wait, Alright, so uh, let's get started. First, I'm going to talk about my G1. And, yeah, we got Ustream going over there, so I might have to, like, uh, just talk to them for a sec, so. So, uh, both of them, by the way, are jailbroken. And, um, so, you know, we got the custom themes going and stuff like that. Um, I'm just gonna turn up, actually, turn down the brightness on that same while I talk okay. about it. Um, alright, so... Uh, basically, this is, that's there because my friend made a mistake cutting out the invisible shield. You guys stop spamming the chat. Or at least Brad stops spamming. Second. Yeah, that's good. Alright, um, but just ignore that little thing. Uh, they're both 16 gigabyte, by the way. Um, comparing the backs here, uh, as you guys mostly know, this one has a straight back and this one has a curved back. Metallic. Um, Kind of see the mirror image of me and both of them, which is kind of weird. Um, but that's pretty much it. It has those; these things are the Wi-Fi things. This one extends to out here, and then this one doesn't. I um I prefer the curved back on my G1 one G2 G2 because um it fits a lot better in your ha in your hand compared to like the kind of boxy feeling of it. I used yeah. to have a first gen. Um, yeah, he's yeah, had both. It does feel a lot better in the hands. Yeah, that's true. I never really noticed that, but that's a good, good thing. Uh, the back of it, this one has the black extends over here, and then this one it has the silver, which extends to the front, which it I is. like. Kind of like the look of the iPhone. Yeah, there's obviously no outer black rim. There's probably a lot of people who can't even mistake the iPod Touch between the iPhone. You mean who can mistake? Who can? can't tell like it's hard to tell right that's without the like the speaker and yeah <laughs> they're still spamming they, they the made chat. them look awesome all right similar. also the other major difference is of course side view um volume control on g2 and no volume control there and obviously speaker other side view is not really anything speaker right in the uh proprietary apple port it's you, you can't really see it, but it's somewhere in there. Yeah. Um, the volume it isn't the loudest, but if there's nothing like going going on in the background, it's it's perfectly fine. It's good enough. Yeah, and Apple says it's for casual mm -hmm. listening. It's not really a listen to music, but yeah. since they're advertising the G2 as also sort of a gaming device, um, and yeah, it's that's what it's definitely good with. for games. It's good enough for games. Yeah, I actually know someone who sold his DS just because he got an iPod Touch. So. Really? <laughs> Alex. Oh my God. <laughs> Um, anyway, so, uh, the, the camera went off for the streamers. Hold on, I just gotta turn that back on. Alright. So, um, turning it on, you basically get the same interface. There's no real difference in the, uh, firmware. The so, iPod Touch 2G does have a Bluetooth inside it. Correct. Um, for the Nike. You can't really use the Bluetooth without, if you're not gonna use the Nike, though, unless it's jailbroken, right. which they're releasing something soon. Mm -hmm. um, the one difference if you're looking for jailbreak is... You can um, obviously, the, the um, iPod Touch second generation jailbreak is tethered, meaning if it runs out of battery or you shut it off, you cannot reboot it unless you were connected to a computer. And then once you're connected, you have to use a, a special program to reboot it and uh, be able to use it again. Right, and then the G1 isn't like that. Uh, the dev team isn't releasing the... They already figured out the untethered jailbreak, but they don't want to release it because... Because um, then the I... They figure the Apple will I figure Apple out... Will figure fix, out the, they'll uh, fix the exploit. Right, and then they'll have to redo it when they get the new iPhone that comes out. Yeah. All right, uh, so that's pretty much it. We pretty much covered all the hardware. I mean... There's not that much of a difference. This isn't like a full major new iPod. Yeah. Like, yeah. it's basically just... Uh, oh yeah, this one has invisible shield on front and back too, by the way. So that's why there's bubble there. 
yeah. So, um, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, if you want to check out SBag129's channel, link will be in the description over there. Sorry. Um, but he mostly posts rock band videos, so look forward more kind to that. So look forward more to that if you're into that. So, um, quickly I'll show you who's in my stream. Stupid noob spamming. Yeah, they're all spamming really right now. But we got Coco Krispies, iPod Touch 1G, 2G, 3G, John Leo Scott, Video Guy Man 7, and just a random you streamer. Uh, not that many people, but we're just kind of having fun streaming right now. Anyway, so, uh, and then there's the camera. So, thank you guys for watching.